I was born in eastern province, eastern part of Zambia, in 1966. I was a driver as well as a carpenter. I loved the most especially moving up and down because I knew so many places as a driver. I really enjoyed the job. When I was 34 years, my life changed forever. That day, I saw a blister developed on the left leg. After some hours, it was another blister on the other leg. And then my legs turned black. I went to hospital, they discovered that I had gas can gleam. That's a disease I was affected with. And then the doctors just decided for this man to survive, you just have to amputate both legs. It pained me. I nearly committed suicide. I thought that my life has ended. I will never drive again. I will never do my carpentry job. But through God's mercy and then the support of some religious people, I came back to my senses. I just had to accept to say, let it be the way it's supposed to be. After being amputated, I can no longer drive, but I used my carpentry skill to do the carpentry job. One day, my friend asked me to do this carpentry job at his workshop. Zambian Association for Children with Disabilities. Uh, this association deals with mobility aid for children with disabilities. I was really touched one time when I went around the children world to see young children face some difficulties how to move. I was so touched so that I know I've got that skill to make them wooden crutches to help them to move here and there. I can do it despite the way I am. I can still help them so that they don't feel depressed or they don't feel bad the way they are. From 8 to 16.30, making some crutches, some braces, special chairs, and then standing frames, different says for children with disabilities. When I see a child using the crutches I make, I feel very good. And when I see a child putting on some braces, I really praise God because he is the one who gives me strength to make those things. I know that in future, those devices I make, they can make them walk and they can make them to be perfect persons. I always make some devices for children with disabilities, but I feel and I believe one day, Someone is going to do wonders for me again. Like making some artificial limbs for me, for me to stand and run and do whatever a normal person can do. And now that dream has come true, I'm very excited about it. There's an organization called 500 Miles, which have supported me to buy me some artificial limbs. I know that one day I will drive again.
Life can change any time. And you have to accept it the way it comes to you. I urge people who can be found in the situation I am to have that heart of accepting whatever can happen to them. Have that heart of prayer every time because things can change any time. You want to make some steps? Yeah. Okay, go ahead. This day and then come back. Life is a, like a ball game because there are ups and downs in life. So you just have to accept the way things come to you.